Good morning, everyone. I'm Crystal Mendoza, and this is Colton High's very own. We will be providing you with a variety of updates about school, weather, local stories, and even worldwide stories. Please join us for the sports and club meeting segments managed by Catalina Guillen. Catalina? Hello, Cool and Yellow Jackets. I'm Catalina Guillen, and I'm here to talk about your club slash sports meetings that will be happening next week. Miss Leva will be hosting her 3 o'clock meeting about her banned book club, so if you're interested in reading books or finding new books, please sure to enter the call. And if you are interested about Crafts Club, they'll be having a meeting on Monday at 3.30 p.m. But if you're interested in volleyball, well, volleyball will be having a meeting at 3.30 on Thursday. And if you have any more concerns about volleyball, please sure to follow or email coltongirlvolleyball at gmail.com. But if you're interested about our wellness club, our wellness club is very great. So if you're interested, please feel free to enter the meeting at 3.30 on Thursday and contact Mr. Alvarez if you have any questions or concerns. Thank you, Catalina, and hello, Yellow Jackets. My name is Jocelyn Jason, and I will be informing you about class event announcements, senior information, and freshman follow-up reminders. For starters, we have class event announcements. Attendance gaming night will be held February 26 at 3.30 p.m. and those who have perfect attendance for the month will receive a special invitation to play games and earn prizes. Next, yearbooks. Yearbooks are on sale now. Be sure to purchase yours online for $90 till March 19th, 2021. Prices will go up to $95 starting March 20th, 2021, so buy yours now. A limited number of books will be ordered and once they are gone, that is it, so order yours as soon as possible. Finally, be sure to tell your parents about Pastry with the Principal. Pastry with the Principal will be held February 24th, 2021 at 4 p.m. for Spanish speakers and 5 p.m. for English speakers. Pastry with the Principal is to inform parents about class event information. Next, we have senior information. Seniors, your last day to purchase an ad in the yearbook will be today, February 19th, 2021. If you have not created one and you would like to, check your email into your senior information sent by Mrs. Buskirk on instructions to do so. Lastly, save the date. Graduation has been moved to Thursday, May 27th, 2021 at 6.30 p.m. The plan for graduation has not been finalized yet and is determined upon COVID numbers in our county. Reminders, cap and gowns will be distributed April 29th, 2021. Lastly, we have freshman follow-ups. Freshman follow-ups are held every other Wednesday during your PE period. The next freshman follow-up isn't until Wednesday, March 3rd, 2021. Be sure to come and join Link with Link Crew which is a social hour for students run by students every Monday at 2.15 p.m. through March 29th, 2021. Be sure to add the Google Classroom code at YGNUE2X and join the Google Meet. Link with Lead Crew is open to all students and we hope to see you there. Now, here's Catalina Guillen with your COVID updates. Hi, I'm Catalina Guillen, and I'm here to talk about your COVID updates. Well, as we all know, we're still in a pandemic, so the COVID updates will still remain the same. However, what I can say is make sure you guys social distance yourself, make sure you guys wear your mask, and stay safe out there. Hi, my name is Tiffany Ramirez, and here are the birthday shoutouts for the month of February. To Gabriel Galindo, happy birthday, and I can't wait to see you one day, from Angelina Sanchez. To Alexa Delamentes, happy birthday, Alexa. Thank you for being such a good friend throughout these couple of months. From Melanie Acosta. To Erin Delatore, happy birthday, Dallas, Texas. Have a good day. From Bradley Romo. Also to Erin Delatore, happy birthday, Erin. From Janet Alcantar. To Natalie Romo, happy birthday, girly. Hope you have a great day. From Julia Romo. To Alexa Delamentes, happy birthday to myself, 15 years old. Thank you to everyone who submitted birthday shout outs and now to Joseph for the weather. Thank you. Hello, my name is Joseph Duran and I'll be bringing you the weather.
Today, expect a high of 72 degrees and a low of 45. For the rest of the week, skies should be clear. However, on Tuesday, it should be cloudy with a 49% humidity. Temperatures will vary over the week from 48 degrees to 78 degrees. Thank you. Jocelyn? Thank you for the weather updates, Joe. Now, here I am again, Jocelyn Jason, with CIF slash sports updates. We need to wait for the county as well as the district for the green light to return to play and to practice. We're waiting for infection rates to lower in our county for that green light in which the district is monitoring. As soon as we get enough information on returning to play or to practice, we will get this information to you. If you have any other questions, feel free to men message Colton Athletics on Instagram or on Twitter. These accounts are run by the athletic director, so he will point you in the right directions. Now, here is Lisa Suchel with the Student of the Month highlights. Hi, Yellow Jackets. My name is Lisa Suchel, and this week's Student of the Month is Luciana Lopez. Here are a few words from her. Hello, my name is Luciana Lopez, or Lucy, and I received the Student of the Month Award for Art. Um, I would just like to say thank you to Ms. Prince for choosing me, as well as to say that I am truly grateful and that I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for that clip, Luciana, and now for your news flash story. This month's student forum will focus on celebrating diversity at CHS all year round and how CHS can promote more cultures on campus. <laughs> the student forum will be held on Tuesday, February 23rd from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. And now here is Leslie with your local stories. Thank you, Lisa. For this week's local story, on February 13, Loma Linda received an expected dosage of the COVID vaccine. A dozen veterans were the first to get the first dosage. Veterans 65 years or older and with high-risk conditions are qualified to get the vaccine in the San Bernardino area. Many people were happy to get the vaccine. Next up, we have Tiffany with her special story. For our special story, for our special story this week, I'll be talking about the Wellness Fair. The Wellness Fair will take place March 10th, 11th, and 12th from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. There will be drawings throughout this event, including a $200 Amazon gift card. In addition, there will be performances, including a magic show and a keynote from renowned poet Natty Carazosa. In order for you to participate, you must register for this event at www.wellnessfair.org before March 1st. A special invitation link will be provided to you, all registered patients before the event. Now to Leslie Padilla for our staff moment highlight. Thank you, Tiffany. This month's staff of the month is Mr. Silveria and Mrs. Ramirez. Here are a few words from them. Yo, what up? Thanks for that uh, nice little uh, gift out there for our Colton Yellow Jackets. You jackets keep me warm. I appreciate it. My name is Silvera. I teach AP Macro, AP Copo, the multicultural class. All right. U.S. history. Appreciate it. You got a lot to choose from, but you chose me. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You jackets keep me warm. Watch out. I got to go. Hello, everybody. I'm Mrs. Ramirez Haldeman. Uh, I teach biology and chemistry at Colton High School, and I just wanted to say thank you so very much. I'm so honored to have been selected as your staff member of the month. Again, thank you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much, Mr. Silveria and Mrs. Ramirez. Congrats. Next up, we have College Info with Valeria. Hi guys, I'm here with College Updates. Now March 2nd is the deadline for the FAFSA and California Dream Act application. March 5th is the deadline for the Lynx Incorporated Scholarship. Now moving on with grades, if you're one of the students who really need help making up their grades from last semester, depending on your grade level and situation, the following could be options that you can discuss with your counselor. First up, we have credit recovery, additional periods, work experience classes, career express, 
summer school. And with summer school, you can possibly earn up to 20 credits and other options. Now for sophomores and juniors, um, the College Board is hosting a series of virtual college fairs called Big Future Days, where you can sign up for a chance to connect directly with college admissions representatives, explore colleges, and ask questions about topics you want to learn about. That's all for college updates. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, my name is Joseph Duran, and I'll be talking about the pickup dates for food, material, and supplies. Every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m., the Rancho Bus Loading Zone will be open for students who need to pick up textbooks or return Mount Functioning Chromebooks or hotspots. The Colton Joint Unified School District is also offering grab-and-go meals, which include two days worth of food. These meals you can pick up on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at DRC, Bernie, Grant, Wilson, Joe Baca Middle School, Zimmerman, Cooley Ranch, Bloomington High School, Rogers, Lewis, Lincoln, McKinley, Crestmore, Grand Terrace High School, and Grand Terrace Elementary School. Just a reminder, our office will be open Monday, Wednesday, and Friday by appointment only from 8 a.m. to 12. Please remember our staff is working remotely over other times. So please leave a message and they'll call back. Thank you. This has been Colton High's very own. I'm Crystal Mendoza, and on behalf of our team, we are pleased to provide you with accurate and weekly news. Take care, Yellow Jackets.